So right along here, you can see that there's a vein running along my hand. And if I were to take a knife and cut right on the vein, the blood that comes out of that will be different than the blood that would come out from where I normally would cut. If I cut here where the vein isn't, then all of a sudden I see a red color of blood. But if I take the same knife and instead I cut right along the vein, what you'll see is that the blood that comes out is actually blue instead of that red color. Break that skin. And so you can see even here where I kind of cut over here, here when we cut into the vein that we get this blue color of blood instead of the red on the side. And that's because the oxygen in the blood that's in veins is different than the blood that's in your capillaries or coming from your arteries. And that's why those two come out different. So if you have a biology teacher, be sure to ask them about how the blue blood in your veins is different from the red blood that's in your arteries. And they can probably give you a pretty good explanation about that. So it's important when you're learning about blood not to just follow what other people tell you, but to actually look at evidence. And so there's two kinds of blood. There's the kind that flows through your arteries, which are located a little bit deeper into your, into your body. And then there's the kinds that flow back through veins. So right here, I have a vein that kind of runs right along here. And whereas in other parts of my body, I don't have that. So if I were to cut my hand with a knife, if I were to really kind of get in there, what you'll see is that the blood there is red because it's arterial blood, and that's actually from the capillaries. You can kind of see that. But if I were to cut along a vein instead, like right on there, the blood that comes out is blue instead of that red color. And that's because that is venous blood that we're getting out from there instead of the other kind. Ideas about what the different kinds of blood are, there's two kinds, because when you have blood running through an artery in your body, it has oxygen, and that changes the color to red. So if you were to cut, and you were to access arterial blood, which I'm just gonna get capillaries here, but you can see that when I cut, but if I were to cut exactly where the vein is on my hand, right here, oh my. Oh no! The venous blood is blue because there's no oxygen in the thing, whereas this is red. It's just blue.